Hi everyone! In this video, you're going to discover 20 computer and technology basics you must learn as a beginner. My name is Lauren, and this channel is all about showing you how to become a highly paid IT pro fast. Let's get started. Do you want an IT career that can pay you over 100,000 US dollars per year? Visit the career resources section in the description area of this video to learn more. In an increasingly technological world, it's crucial to familiarize yourself with basic computer and technology skills. In this video, I'll cover 20 fundamental computer and technology basics you should know. If you don't know them, you would do well to research them further. On the other hand, if you do know some or all of them, then great, you're ahead of the curve. Hardware. Computer hardware refers to the tangible parts of a computer, the parts you can physically touch. This includes components like the central processing unit, CPU, hard drive, random access memory, RAM, graphics processing unit, GPU, and peripherals like the keyboard and mouse. Understanding the function of each part can help you troubleshoot issues and better understand how your computer works. It will also enable you to build your own computer, tailoring it to your unique needs without paying a premium for a custom configured computer from a manufacturer. Software. Software is the non-tangible aspects of your computer, the programs and applications that make your computer functional. This includes everything from your operating system and web browsers to word processors and games. Software is what enables you to interact with your computer hardware and do the things you need to do operationally. Operating systems. The operating system, or OS, is the most critical piece of software on your computer. It manages all other software and hardware on the system and provides a user-friendly interface to interact with your computer. Operating system examples include Windows, Mac OS, iOS, and Linux. Some of those operating systems may be easier to use than others, but even knowing how to be dangerous with one is a fantastic skill to have. Internet browsers. Internet browsers like Google Chrome, Mozilla Firefox, Microsoft Edge, and Safari are your gateway to the internet. They facilitate your access to search for information, shop online, watch videos, and more. Knowing how to use a browser, including managing tabs and bookmarks and understanding privacy settings, is essential for navigating the internet. Keyboard shortcuts. Keyboard shortcuts are combinations of keys that perform certain actions, enabling you to work more efficiently. For example, Control plus C copies highlighted text and Control plus B pastes it. There are many more standard keyboard shortcuts, and knowing even some of them automate manual processes and make your work or play that much more efficient. File management. File management involves creating, saving, organizing, and deleting files and folders on your computer. Effective file management makes it easier to find your documents, photos, and other data when needed. Knowing how to manage your files can make you a more efficient employee, developer, and general computer user. Instead of hunting and pecking for information, it's at your fingertips ready to go. That can save precious minutes to hours over the course of a day. It can also make using and interacting with a computer much less frustrating. Troubleshooting. Basic troubleshooting skills can help you resolve common tech problems like a slow computer or unresponsive application. This can include steps like restarting your device, closing and reopening an application, or checking your internet connection. Cybersecurity Cybersecurity involves protecting your computer and data from digital threats. This includes using strong, unique passwords, keeping your software up to date, and not opening suspicious emails or downloads. No matter how you use your computer, this is a critical skill to have. It's almost guaranteed you have some critical data on your computer, 
whether that be corporate information, tax returns, passwords, banking information, family pictures, and other sources of critical data. Preserving all of that from loss or theft means knowing how to use your computer and the internet safely. Put differently, not understanding basic cybersecurity is just asking for critical data loss and theft. Privacy and data protection. Protecting your personal data online is critical. This involves not sharing sensitive information like your address or social security number online, regularly reviewing your privacy settings on online accounts, and being cautious of requests for personal information. Safe web browsing. Safe web browsing involves taking steps to protect yourself while using the internet. This includes recognizing and avoiding suspicious links, using secure websites, those that start with HTTPS, and not downloading from untrustworthy sources. Email management. Email management is an essential skill in both personal and professional settings. It involves creating and responding to emails, organizing your inbox, and understanding email etiquette. Communicating digitally is critical, so understanding how to do so and locating critical information when needed is a must. Digital etiquette. In the same vein as email management, digital etiquette, or netiquette, involves behaving respectfully and responsibly online. In short, it's how to communicate online as you'd communicate in an interpersonal conversation in the physical world. This includes not typing in all caps, which is perceived as yelling, respecting others' privacy, and not sharing inappropriate or offensive content. Since communicating via text can be easily misinterpreted, understanding netiquette is tantamount to understanding social norms with verbal communication. Social media. Social media platforms like Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram are essential tools for connecting with others, sharing content, and staying informed. Understanding these platforms includes knowing how to create posts, interact with others' content, and manage privacy settings. You can share a lot without knowing how to share a lot, and you can offend easily without intending to do so. Word processing. Word processing software such as Microsoft Word or Google Docs is used for creating, editing, and formatting text documents. Knowing how to use such software is critical for tasks like writing essays, creating resumes, and more. You don't need to be an expert in every feature, but you do need to know the basic functionality of at least one word processor. Cloud storage. Cloud storage services like OneDrive, Google Drive, Amazon, or Dropbox allow you to store and access data over the internet instead of on your computer's hard drive. This can provide backup for your files and allow you to access them from any device with an internet connection. Chances are you use cloud storage on a daily basis and you might not even know you're doing so. Developing that understanding is critical for appropriate resource use and level setting your expectations to make life's conveniences less frustrating. Online communication tools. Tools like Zoom, Slack, and Microsoft Teams enable real-time communication and collaboration online. They are commonly used in professional settings for meetings, presentations, and team collaboration you may have used them robustly during COVID. If you didn't, many other people did and still do, so it would be a good idea to learn them. Computer maintenance. Regular computer maintenance helps keep your device running smoothly and extends its lifespan. This includes tasks like regularly updating software, cleaning up unnecessary files, and physically cleaning your device. Spreadsheet navigation. Spreadsheets, like those in Microsoft Excel or Google Sheets, are used to organize, analyze, and store data. Basic understanding includes knowing how to create and format cells, use formulas, and create charts or graphs. Presentation tools. 
Presentation software like PowerPoint or Google Slides is critical for creating visual presentations. These tools can be used for everything from school projects to business presentations and include functions like inserting text and images, creating slide transitions, and more. The computer and technology basics covered in this video serve as a foundation for further learning. As technology continues to evolve, so too will the skills required to navigate it. Keep exploring, stay curious, and continue to build on these basics as you become more comfortable and proficient in the digital world. Check out the video on the right for more content to help you develop your IT career.